Okay, I want to give a quick uh, quick shout out to the project. Um, you know, one of the things I thought I needed the project, um, in my life I'd grown fairly complacent. I was, I was comfortable in my life. I uh, have a good job, I have a great family, um, and, and I was starting to get fairly healthy. Uh, but, you know, I saw the comments on the, the project and it piqued my interest. And as I looked further and further into it, it looked like something that I needed in my life. And, uh, and so I went ahead and I signed up for it and, and went full force into it. Uh, there's a couple things that the project did for me. The project physically reminded me of what I'm capable of doing, how that I can push myself beyond the limits that I thought I'd train myself that I thought were possible. It, it reprogrammed me and reminded me of the things that I can do physically. Uh, mentally, it pushed me mentally. Uh, past points that I thought that, that I shouldn't, couldn't be past, pushed past. Anyway, um, and, and so it's got my thinking cleared up. Uh, just all in all, and team building. Um, I'm not one who has many friends, associates, and the, the group of men that I went through the project with, you know, you always get there at the first and you're like, oh man, I don't know about this group. You know, that, that 75 hours of being together all the time and bonding with those men uh, are things that, that would remind you of your best friends that you met in, in grade school, high school, college, whatever. It, it just gave you a, a great opportunity to bond with, with men again, rebond and, and create new friendships. Um, you know, the, during the project, we talked about the three Fs, fitness, finances, and family. And I'm going to go in the order of, of family. The things that the project helped me with is my family is, you know, I thought I was doing a pretty good job, and I think I am, but it gave me some more things to think about as I help raise my boys to become men, uh, to teach them, you know, to go back and teach them how to be courteous to women, how to how to always be courteous to women and, and those those other people that, that they're around, to, to be a gentleman, to show everyone respect, um, and to always try and better a situation with people in whatever situation they're in. So it gave me a thing to work with on my family and my wife. It helped us, uh, help me uh, rekindle uh, our our friendship and, and our love for each other. Um, in in my fitness, you know, I started a program in January that's, that's helped me lose 40 pounds, get back in shape, do things that I never thought possible. As I sit there and do things now, I, I think, man, back in high school, that didn't seem that hard. You know, now as a 40 year old man, doing those same things again at 40, it's not like you're in high school anymore. Um, you have to push yourself. You have to, to make yourself physically go after those things that you want. And and the project helped me realize that. And then in my finances, you know, we were fairly comfortable, struggling a little bit here and there. Um, I've had thoughts and ideas since the project where I can cut the fat out, where I can be aggressive, invest my time and money to get a better return for me to, to, to free up my time to spend with my family and on my fitness. Um, all these things, the, the project's a wonderful thing. So if you're if you're teetering on whether you wanna do the project or not, just, just think about your family, what you wanna do to improve um, your situation there. Your, your fitness, if it's lacking, it'll get you jump started again, get you back in shape. And as you're in shape, your mind works better. Uh, your wife will like you better. Your kids will make fun of you. And then your finances. Uh, when all of these things are firing on all pistons, life's just great I, you know i have a long way to go and a, and a really a short time to get there no pun intended but uh the projects help restart my restart rekindle my fire and desire to be a better man period so if you're at all on the borderline about it just do it and you'll be a better man for it thank you have a great day